to my children. Hello and welcome to Demi's Daily Grind. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you're doing well. My name is Dumi and my journey began on the 13th of October 2021. If you are new, here I talk about recovery, spiritual growth, mental health issues, sobriety, relapses and spiritual well-being, focusing mainly on the daily work, the grind, that goes into finding peace of mind, contentment and freedom from addiction. If this is something you are interested in, please subscribe as I release new content regularly and hopefully we will travel together on this journey toward finding enlightenment. To my children, hello my sons, you have heard my heart beating while in my womb and I hope you hear my heart the same way when I give you a hug. I hope you remember that sound as it is the sound of my love for you. People always say that there is no love like a mother's love and because of you, I have had the privilege to experience it. Every time I look into your eyes, touch your skin, feel you breathe and hear your voice, I have received the greatest gift from you and that gift is unconditional love. Life is filled with people who give and receive love, attached with conditions and unfortunately, I have experienced that many times. Today, I realize that the love I have for you is the purest and for that I am grateful. You came through me from my higher power and I am absolutely honored to be given the task of feeding you, teaching you, encouraging you watching you grow like the sunflowers I planted weeks ago in my yard. I am honored to be the one chosen by God to have you next to me physically, emotionally, spiritually and always in your little corner in my conscience. I am your mother, the one who was trusted by your soul to provide the guidance for your physical and mental state while you travel your journey on this earth, this plane, this universe. I am grateful that your spirit chose me to be your carer, your nurturer and your security and your warmth and kindness. I am privileged to have felt your heart beating to mine when you were first introduced to this cold, bright and noisy environment when you took your first breath I am happy to have been there to hear the very first time you heard your own voice. In the chaos of that hospital room, seeing so many faces pricking and prodding and cutting and spanking, and even holding you so roughly as if you were not as fragile as I thought you were. I am blessed to have to hold you when you are not feeling well, to give you warmth, to give you medication soft comforting voice telling you that everything will be okay at the end of it all. I am grateful to be trusted to help you feel safe when you are scared and anxious as the world we live in can be very scary sometimes. I am fulfilled to be the one who explains the meaning of things as you discover them and answer all your questions to the best of my ability. I hope God will forgive me if I passed on incorrect information. As a mere human, I only know what I know. I am lucky to have the wisdom to say to you and to be honest and admit when I don't know, when you ask me difficult questions and you have asked me many of those. But you are lucky that we have Google now and can actually double check. I have been so lucky to be reminded how good life is and how blessed I am because I get to meet you, I get to know you, I get to see you grow and I get to let you go when you are ready to be you without me. I am but a vessel on your journey and soon you will get off and make your own way. 
I get to learn real love because you will leave one day and I will be proud to let you go. I cherish all the milestones I get to experience with you on your journey and every day I learn something new because you are in my life. Yes, I will protect you, I will love you, I will honor you and guide you for as long as you need me to, unashamedly so. I will gladly place myself in harm's way to ensure you are safe. I am your mother, the one who experiences unconditional love for you daily. And today I assure you that no matter how harsh the world may see, you just don't have to experience all the pain that comes with it. Because I will remind you that after the pain passes, the joy comes. After a dark storm, the sun rays will appear. After you fall, you will heal. After you cry, you will experience peace. The world we live in right now works that way. We are beings that get to experience it all. Love, joy, excitement, hope, grace, freedom, a constant development, wisdom and enlightenment. I have to thank you for being part of my journey in this life and am honored to be part of yours. I love you and no, not the same way. I love you differently because you are unique individuals who deserve 100% of my love dedicated to you and suited for your own journey. You come from the same womb, but God has blessed you in so many different ways that you deserve your own kind of love, not your brother's kind of love. When the road seems hard, just know that everything will be okay. Nothing is a mistake. It is just a means of learning and growing. I hope you get to reach a new potential every day and grow wiser every day. I thank you for being part of my life and honoring me to be part of yours. With all my love, Mama.